Unit 113, Multi-Screen Movie Theaters. I'm thinking of moving. Uh-huh. Where do you feel like living? I feel like living downtown. I'm fed up taking the car every time I need to go out. Don't you get used to it? Yes, but it's a pity to get used to something like that. And I'm looking forward to having some nice restaurants to go to and meeting interesting people and having a multi-screen movie theatre with ten different movies right under my home. I agree about having restaurants near, but I find movie theatres boring. What? I love them. I like to go to the movies and relax. Very often I go by myself. I find movie theatres uncomfortable. You have to queue up to buy the tickets and then again to go in. You sit beside someone you don't know at all for two hours and sometimes this person spends the whole time eating popcorn. And often you have to go through all this just to watch a bad movie. What a pessimistic view of the cinema. Nevertheless, I love it. Especially the multi-screen movie theatres with ten different movies and the small rooms for 150 people. We have different points of view. These small rooms have an aggressive air conditioning system. The sound's too high and there's probably someone behind you kicking your seat. Everything's out of your control. You just have to pull up with it. Scott, stop being so neurotic. You're getting old. Well, that's another thing. But I'm convinced that movie theatres are going to disappear. Multi-screen movie theatres are a recent invention. A bit of oxygen for the movie business before it disappears completely. But the end is near. They're not a product of the 21st century. And what's going to happen? Will the movie industry disappear? No, on the contrary. Homes will have more perfect TV screens every day. Movies will reach our homes the same day they're released via cable. And will it still be profitable to produce a film? Much more than now. Movies will normally be released on Fridays, and with good publicity, millions of people in the whole world will pay to see the movie in the first few days. Sometimes, the movie will cover its costs in one weekend. But it's not the same. You measure the TV screen by inches, and the movie theatre screen by metres. Yeah, but it's easier to broadcast a movie to millions of homes than it is to get millions of people to move, to make two queues, and to get into a room with people eating popcorn. Hey, you don't have a problem with popcorn by any chance. Well, maybe I do, although I sometimes eat it. Because if you eat it too, then you don't smell it that much. <laughs> oh, God, and it's so noisy when they eat it. And the bags are huge. Sometimes they almost last throughout the whole movie. It's a torture. Well, forget about multi-screen movie theatres. How do you feel about living right in the centre? Not bad. There are cafes like this one close by. There's a special atmosphere at breakfast time. It's important to start the day with a cafe atmosphere and a newspaper. Or a friend like you to talk to. That's true. Okay, I'll rent an apartment and I'll give it a try. Okay. Maybe we'll become neighbours. But don't ask me to go to the movies. No, I promise. <laughs>